This video is going to be my top 10 Star Wars Funko Pops for 2021. Let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, my name is Christopher. Welcome to Seriously Star Wars. On this channel, I do weekly Star Wars reviews, and I also do top 5 and top 10 lists, just like this one. So if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. So I originally wanted to do a top 5 Star Wars Funko Pops of 2021, but there were just so many Funko Pops that came out this year for the, the various Star Wars lines, like Star Wars Rebels, The Clone Wars, there were a bunch for The Mandalorian Season 2 that came out. So there, there were just so many Funko Pops that came out, so couldn't narrow it down that much. So we're doing the top 10 Star Wars Funko Pops of 2021. And just to be clear, everything that I mentioned in this video, they're all Star Wars Funko Pops that were released in 2021. And they're all Star Wars Funko Pops that I personally own in my collection. So none of the Funko Pops in this video are ones that I don't own myself. So, without further ado, let's jump into the list. Alright, so the first Funko Pop on my list is the Grogu with the squid, the, the chowder squid. So, had to have at least one Grogu on my list here for 2021. This guy stood out as, as a favorite, one of my favorite Grogu's of this year. So this guy is at, at number 10 in the, the 10th spot as my 10th favorite Star Wars Funko Pop this year. And like I said... This guy just stood out as, as as a favorite for me amongst the rest of the Grogu's that I, I own in my collection. Just, he looks so, so terrified of that squid that's on his face. And the scene is just pure comedy. You know, he's, he's eating that chowder and then that squid jumps out at him. And, and Din Djarin says, you know, stop playing with your food. So such a great Funko Pop from such a great scene. I already did a review on this guy, so I won't go into a lot of detail on, on this Funko Pop, but number 10 is Grogu with the Chowder Squid. Alright, sitting at number 9 on my list of top 10 Star Wars Funko Pops for 2021, another Mandalorian Funko Pop from Season 2 as well. This one is the Bo-Katan Funko Pop, and she's in that action pose, you know, she's got one foot kind of leaning back as, as if she's walking and she's got both blasters out ready to fight such a great looking Funko Pop I have a I have another uh, Bo-Katan Funko Pop from the Clone Wars that came out last year and they're both great this this one's got some battle damage on the the helmet and stuff and once again I did a review on this one so go and check out these reviews that I did I'll, I'll leave a link to the playlist in the description below as well and I'll put a I'll put a card up here for you guys to check out as well. So number nine is Bo Katan from Star Wars: The Mandalorian season two. All right, so coming in at number eight, I have a, yet another Mandalorian Star Wars Funko Pop from season two of The Mandalorian. This time it is the Mandalorian unmasked holding Grogu, and such a great pop from such an emotional scene. This is from chapter 16 where he's handing Grogu to Luke there so such an emotional scene one of the only times we see Din Djarin without his mask and they did a really great job of this Funko Pop as well like I said a lot of Mandalorian Funko Pops that we got this year from season two of the Mandalorian and this one just stood out as one of my favorites just because of the him holding the little Grogu there such an emotional scene like I said they did a really great job on this Funko Pop. So number number seven, or sorry, number number eight is Din Djarin, the Mandalorian, unmasked, holding Grogu. Okay, number seven on the list is the Darth Maul. This is number 450 in the series. He's a Chalice Collectibles exclusive down in the States. He's just a, a special edition, comes with a special edition sticker up here in Canada. But this is the one that has a dark saber in one hand and his, his red lightsaber in the other hand. Just a really awesome Funko Pop from the Star Wars The Clone Wars series. 
Not going to go into a bunch of uh, detail on this guy. I did a review on him, so if you want to check that out again, just, uh, links will be in the description below. But this is number seven, the Darth Maul Chalice Collectibles. Exclu exclusive, number 450. So coming in at number six is the Ray Star Wars Funko Pop. This is the 2021 Summer Convention exclusive. This was a shared exclusive with Amazon, I believe. This one's just got that really awesome stance from The Force Awakens. And she comes on a different base, so not your typical black Star Wars Funko Pop base. So this one's made to look like she's standing on the sand. So different base. I really like how, how Funko does that with uh, some of the Funko Pops. And I do have another one on this list that comes on a different base as well. But this is number six. This is the Rey Star Wars Funko Pop. From Star Wars The Force Awakens, the 2021 Summer Convention exclusive. Okay, so moving on to number 5 on the list. This is the Gaming Greats RC1138 Boss Funko Pop from the the Gaming Greats collection. Uh, he is from the Star Wars Republic Commando video game. And he's been he's made a couple of other appearances in... Uh, in canon here is such as the bad batch and i think he was in the clone wars at some point there but just a really awesome stance this one is a eb games slash gamestop exclusive he does have the glow in the dark visor there that glows in the dark and just just an awesome stance really cool character as well he's got that blaster in the one hand and the the two fingers pointing with the other hand so Really love this one. So number number five is the RC-1138 Boss. Republic Commando Boss. So coming in at number four, I have the Princess Leia, the Amazon exclusive Princess Leia Yavin. Um, Yavin Princess Leia, Amazon exclusive. She's part of that Across the Galaxy lineup that Amazon, that is exclusive to Amazon, so... She comes in that, that Yavin ceremony dress, and it just looks fantastic. Really great looking Funko Pop. Again, it comes on a, a different base, so it comes on the gray base. Meant to look like the the floor of the, the throne room, or the ceremony room on Yavin. So, really great Funko Pop. This is the Amazon exclusive Yavin Princess Leia, coming in at number four. So coming in at number three is another exclusive. This one is exclusive to Hot Topic. This is the General Grievous Funko Pop from, I believe this one is from Revenge of the Sith. So th this one has all four lightsabers wielding on this one. Unlike the Walgreens exclusive one that was released a few years back that only had the two lightsabers, this one has all four. And he's got like some dirt and some battle damage, so he looks really awesome. And lately, Funko Pop's been doing a really good job of these these droids or robots or any Funko Pops that have like mechanical limbs or anything like that. So they did a really fantastic job on this one. He looks a lot better than the the original one, I think. Anyways, but number three is the Hot Topic exclusive General Grievous. All right, so moving on to number two on the list. This is another exclusive. This one is a uh, 2021 fall convention exclusive, just newly released. I think th this one came in just last week. This is the Boba Fett, the the kind of nomad Boba Fett Funko Pop. He's in the Tusken Raider gear. He's got the gaffy stick. He's got the Tusken Raider rifle on his back there. He's got all the scarring on him. I haven't done a review on this one yet, but the, the review will be coming in the, the next week or so in the new year here. So stay tuned for the review for that. But this one is a really awesome looking Funko Pop. Great, great scene in that, what is it, chapter 8 of The Mandalorian where where at the end of the episode he, he shows up looking like this. So he just looks really badass with the gaffy stick in hand and the, the rifle on his back ready for battle. And like I said, those scars, they did a really good job of this one. But stay tuned for the full review on this one. So this is the Boba Fett 
the fall ex- the 2021 fall convention exclusive Boba Fett coming in at number two. So finally coming in at number one on my list uh, of top 10 Star Wars Funko Pops of 2021. Another Mandalorian Funko Pop. This time it is the Dark Trooper. This one is the one from Chapter 16 where they're they're marching towards that door of, of the the room on the Star Destroyer where where Bo Katan and Mando and Grogu are hiding. This guy just looks very menacing, and like I said before, similar to the General Grievous, Funko Pop Funko does a great job of their their characters that have that are robots or droids or or whatever, like anyone with a mechanical limb. They do put a lot of detail into it, these, and this one is by far the the most detailed one of them all for the this year and my favorite one um unfortunately the the entertainment earth exclusive dark trooper didn't didn't get released this year that one would have been at the top of my list but this one is at the top of my list at number one this is the dark trooper from star wars the mandalorian season two completing the list at number one but that does it for my top 10 Star Wars Funko Pops of 2021. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think of this list. Do you agree with all of these or any of these? Or what is on your your list of top 10 Star Wars Funko Pops of the year for 2021? Let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and then click over here to watch one of my other reviews. Thank you so much for watching and may the force be with you.